uh, congratulations and welcome to Sweden. Thank you. Thanks. Um, Don't congratulate me yet. We haven't aired yet. I that? know, but <laughs> getting it picked up and yeah. that's an accomplishment. It's a feat in itself. Yeah, it's mind blowing. Uh, I never. I mean, I wrote the show in my attic two years ago, um, and didn't think anybody would read the script. Really? <laughs> yeah, I'd never done anything before, so it's, it was uh, crazy. It was yeah. like a, you know, I dreamed really big that day, and it turns out the reality turned out to be even crazier than the dream. Yeah. Um, what made you want to do it? I always kind of had the idea. I mean, it was it was um, a, it's a very autobiographical show. It's about mm -hmm. my my life, so. Um, it had been something in my head for a long time. Uh, and then I started doing stand-up comedy in, in Sweden, and that was kind of the first step towards me thinking, like, maybe I can do this, yeah. you know. Um, I think prior to that, I, it was something that I always thought I could do, but I never thought I would get the chance. And yeah. I didn't think you could just do that in the middle of your life, just be yeah. like, I'm going to be a, an and actor. You have, you have kids and all this yeah, stuff so going on, yeah, so, so you're busy. And, yeah, just it, it's just tough to go home to your wife and kids and say, like, I'm sorry, I'm going to be an actor. Uh, <laughs> <no>. <laughs> I know you guys are depending on me, but I have a dream. <clears throat> so it was kind of a, a slow um, process. Well, it was, it was an extremely fast process, but for me to actually to, to get to the writing stage, um, yeah, I was just kind of screwing around. Yeah. And, uh, and, and I really said it's going to be a show that's going to be on in Sweden and the U.S. We're going to have tons of cameos, and I'm going to play the lead role. And uh, turns out it all happened. I'm, I'm not sure how, but uh, I don't want to jinx it. Uh, awesome. Yeah, so I'm super appreciative of the opportunity. Obviously, I realize um, how amazing it is. Um, so because of that, I really worked incredibly hard on the show uh, for the past two years. So yeah. now it's like a very vulnerable position to be in to, for, for it to be unleashed on the public. I'm sure it will be well-received, though. Thank you. Um, so I know zero Swedish. Uh, I know that you live there. So can you teach us something? Sure. You want, a common phrase. You want dirty words or? Yeah, obviously. I, I don't know if we can. Is, is after buzz a <laughs> If it's in Swedish, <laughs> like no one will know, right? Well, so. hair in, in Swedish is whore. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's awesome. Yeah. So like, you know, but my three-year-old son one time we were in New York, he pointed at this woman and said, hey, check out that whore, daddy. <laughs> Look at that crazy whore. Are you teaching your kids how to, um, how to swear it in Swedish? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say to be bilingual. Yes, they are bilingual, but that's what I mean. There's there's certain times where they screwed up, which is hilarious to me, but not to anyone else. Douche is a shower, for example. <laughs> so if you want to take a douche, by all means. Getting clean either way, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got oh. like I got a hundred of these. I, I want one more. Um, what, like Swedish words. Tell us a, a phrase. Say, um, watch Welcome to Sweden. Or how would you say you should tune in to Welcome to Sweden? Snälla allihopa, du, ni behöver att uh, titta på Välkommen till Sverige. Yeah. Welcome to Sweden. That sounded like the Swedish yeah. chef from uh, the Muppets. I had no idea what you were saying. talking gibberish. <laughs> you, you have no idea. Awesome. So um, before you go, I have to ask uh, your sister, Amy Poehler. Um, <laughs> just reminded you something. Um, but do you have any embarrassing stories of when you were kids? No, of her or of me? Both. Um, we'll take either. Well, we used to have um, dance contests, uh, she and I, with some neighborhood kids. And uh, that whole scene was very embarrassing. I think it, 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 we, we took it to very strange levels. Um, okay. <coughs> what kind of dancing? Well, it started off, you know, kind of the 80s style uh, break dancing, of course, mm -hmm. and then evolved into some sort of weird, um, I can't even say what, what, what went on in that basement. Okay. It was very, <laughs> very strange 80s stuff. Uh, How good of a dancer are you now? I'm a surprisingly good dancer. Really? Yeah. Do you want to bust a move? I'm actually thinking about going on the uh, Swedish Dancing with the Stars, uh, Swedish version. Wait, really? Yeah. Is that, that's for, for real? Yeah. Oh yeah. my gosh. Let's dance, um, and uh, I think I'm going to be on it next year because why? Why the hell not? <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. yeah. I'm not sure if we should. Maybe I shouldn't be saying that. <laughs> well, <laughs> here's today's scoop. From your lips to the internet, now yeah. it's official. Yeah, I've been practicing. My sister and I had dance contests in the basement when we were very young, and uh, now I'm ready. I think. I don't know. I don't have any formal training or anything like that. I'm not one of those like ringers. I'm just more of a freestylist. Okay. That I think uh, can get things done. 
Well, I am looking forward to Welcome to Sweden and eventually you on Dancing with the Stars in Sweden. Yes. <laughs> yes. I, I hopefully, you know, it won't be as embarrassing <laughs> as I'm now thinking in my head. Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> nice to meet you.